Why do we fall for nutcase nonsense? It's simple, really. It is comforting to imagine someone is in control. Contrast that with the idea of nobody being in control. As Van Jones said in an address at Mills College on June 15, 2007, the people we think are in charge are actually juggling chickens and chainsaws. Obviously, the statement came before Jones was the Green Jobs Advisor to President Barack Obama. Remember when the pandemic first broke out and Fauci and the CDC were giving mixed messages? Of course, there's nothing new about this. It often occurs with the corporate media. A recent example of us silly humans demonstrating our inability to properly respond to a crisis involves the ongoing heat wave in the western United States. The electrical grid in California was threatened by the heat wave, so charging electric cars was off limits. Yes, those electric cars that were supposed to offer a way out of the climate crisis. Never mind that civilization is a heat engine, as pointed out in six peer-reviewed papers, single-authored or lead-authored by Professor Tim Garrett at the University of Utah. Despite all of the excellent work on the topic, nobody seems to understand that civilization itself is a heat engine, regardless of how it is powered. My point? Nobody is in control. At least not with respect to societal issues. Not presidents, not their advisors, certainly not us fragile, self-absorbed humans. And yet people believe we're capable of weather manipulation? Not most people, mind you. Only gullible, ridiculous people who are misinformed. I'll finish with a relevant line from American show business star Woody Allen. Quote, More than any other time in history, mankind faces a crossroads. One path leads to despair and utter hopelessness, the other to total extinction. Let us pray we have the wisdom to choose correctly. End quote. Wishes, hopes, and prayers aside, we have not chosen wisely, at least not at the societal level. As a result, we hover on the edge of extinction, and at the edge of extinction, only love remains. <laughs>